Primary Agriculture Cooperative Credit Societies PACs, have been playing an important role in meeting the credit needs of a large number of farmers, particularly the small and marginal farmers in the rural areas. These societies generally provide credit and other services to its members. Some of the societies have also been providing facilities like input facilities in the form of cash or kind component to members, agriculture implements on hiring basis, and storage facility. It should be possible that the PACs could provide a variety of services such as enabling farmers use scientific storage to minimize storage losses and provide pledge loan to bridge credit gap and many others. In order to serve the village community, particularly the small and marginal farmers, it is desirable that PACs become full-fledged multi-service centers to support PACs to become NSCs, National Bank for Agriculture and Rural Development Nabad has created an exclusive fund called Producers Organization Development Fund PODF under which PACs can create Agro Storage Unit through which farmers will be facilitated to get better price by holding the crops without affecting the fund flow position Agro Service Center for procuring high-tech agri implements like power tiller land leveler, rotary slasher, movers, seed driller, multi-crop planter, paddy transplanter, sprayers, combined harvester, etc. and renting out these equipments to farmers. Agro-processing unit in which primary processing covering, sorting, grading unit, waxing and polishing unit, pre-cooling chambers, and secondary processing covering value addition to produce like mini rice mill, ata chakki and horticulture produce processing can be carried out. Agri Information Center wherein ICT based guidance and service to farmers. Facilities like panel of experts for providing services on payment basis. Knowledge Dissemination Center Arranging training to farmers can also be provided by these centers. Agri-transportation and marketing facilities under which procurement of produce, direct market linkage after aggregation, processing, setting up of rural mart can be carried out. Support from PODF is in the form of a combination of loan and need-based grant. PACs have to provide a minimum margin of 10% of the project cost. However, in case of projects eligible for subsidy from government-sponsored schemes, appropriate margin has to be brought by the PACs. The loan could be repaid with a maximum period of 9 years, including a grace period of up to 2 years. Nabad wishes that PACs avail these benefits and emerge as strong entities and serve as a one-stop shop for the farmers.